Stefan Roth has studied many kinds of swords. The katana is known as the masterpiece of Far Eastern weapons technology. The blade is curved, single-edged, and 25 to 30 inches long. The long sword, on the other hand, has a broad double-edged blade with a very sharp point and measures 32 to 47 inches. How well did the swords perform? Stefan Roth wants to find out. He's with katana warrior Alexander Mantai, who is an expert in Asian martial arts. Can the longsword cut through a 1 16th inch metal plate? And how will the Japanese katana perform? The result of the longsword katana competition, the katana cuts through only half of the steel. With his longsword, Stefan manages to sever the entire steel plate. Our next test, how well do both weapons penetrate? The katana pierces the steel plate with its point. The European sword is, of course, predestined for penetrating because it is long, pointed, and most of all straight. This means the energy can be directed at one point. You can see very nicely how deep the blade has penetrated the metal. Just imagine you'd have a knight wearing armor of maybe not the best quality. It could very well be possible that the sword goes through it. The longsword easily outperforms the katana.